my channel so for today I have this Valentine's Day look for you with a pink cut crease and I also got two lip options with this look so if you want to see how I did this cut crease Valentine's Day look and my second lip option just please keep on watching I'm gonna start to prime my face and today I'm gonna use the Makeup Forever Skin Equalizer, the step one, and this is the smoothing primer. So before I apply my foundation and my concealer and everything, I'm gonna color correct and I'm gonna use the NYX Color Correcting Palette and I will use the green shade and the orange peachy shade. I have been really stressed lately so my skin has really broken out so I have really bad skin right now and it sucks so I will cover up my red spots with some green so now that I have color corrected I'm gonna cover up the green shades in my face and I'm gonna use the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer since it's a full cover from foundation. It's a full cover concealer and this is the shade light medium. And I'm gonna blend it out using my damp beauty blender. Today I'm gonna mix two foundations and the first one is the Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Foundation and if you have seen my latest video you know this is my favorite foundation of all time and this is the shade 220 and the other one is the Makeup Forever Ultra HD foundation in the number 117 so I'm gonna mix those two to get the perfect shade and I'm gonna blend it out using my damp beauty blender For concealer today I'm gonna use the Maybelline Fit Me concealer and the text is gone so I cannot see what the real name is but it's the shade 10 and I think it's the Fit Me concealer. And of course, I'm gonna blend it out using my beauty blender. And before I set my entire face with powder, I'm gonna contour or cream contour. And I'm gonna use the Maybelline Master Contour. Uh, where's the name? There. A B shape duo stick and this is a contour and highlighting stick and I'm gonna use the contour side of it and this is the color 02 medium So now I'm gonna set my concealer and my foundation in place and for my concealer I'm gonna set it with the Laura Mercier uh, Invisible Loose Setting Powder and I'm gonna use my Makeup Forever Professional brush and this is the number 152 brush and it's so soft and it's the perfect brush to set your concealer with. To set the rest of my face, I'm gonna use the NYX Finishing Powder and this is the color Ivory. <coughs> oh my gosh! Oh, I hate sneezing! <laughs> So my base is done and I'm gonna do my eyebrows and for that I'm gonna use the Benefit Cabrow in the color 5.
So I'm gonna set my eyebrows on place and this is the Brow Gel Clear Water Resistant Eyebrow Gel. So, so the look I'm going for today is a very pink look which is very fitting for Valentine's Day. So I'm gonna go in with the Urban Decay Naked 3 palette first and I'm gonna use the shade Nooner. Nooner? Nooner? The brush I'm gonna use is the Morphe M507 brush and I'm gonna put this shade in my crease. And then I'm gonna take a fluffier blending brush and this is the Morphe MB23 brush and I'm gonna go in with this shade limit from the Naked 3 palette. Now I'm moving on to the Huda Beauty Rose Gold Edition palette, which is my favorite one. And I'm gonna go in with the shade Shy and use the same blending brush as before. Then I'm gonna take a very small brush and this is the Morphe M326 brush. And I'm gonna go in with this shade Bossy. And I'm gonna curve out the cut crease line that I want. Then I'm going in with my Morphe M507 brush again. And I'm gonna go in with the shade Bossy again. I want to add some more pink to this look, so I'm going to go in with the shade Flamingo from the Huda Beauty palette. So now it's time to carve out the cut crease and I'm going to use the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer for that. And this is the shade Light and my brush that I'm going to use is the Sigma Precise Lip Line Brush. Okay, so on top of the concealer, I'm gonna use the shade Buzz from the Naked 3 palette from Urban Decay. And I'm gonna pack it on using my Sigma cream color brush and this is the E58 brush. So now I want to smoke out my outer V and I'm gonna use the shade Bossy again from the Huda Beauty Pro Gold palette. And the brush I'm using for that is the Sigma E25 blending brush. I'm gonna go in with the shade Shy and my Morphe M507 brush and I'm gonna smoke out my lower lash line. Then I'm gonna take my Sigma E20 brush and the shade Bossy to deepen it a bit more. Take it off of me, of me, of me, of me now, girl. You're such a wonderful. To highlight my inner corners and my brow bones, I'm gonna use the Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector in the color Moonstone. I think I wanna do a eyeliner today and I'm gonna use the Mellow Gel Eyeliner for that. And to apply it, I'm gonna use the Sigma B12 brush, uh, which is the Benz Liner Brush. And I have never done a eyeliner on camera before, I think. So I'm a bit nervous because I'm so shaky in my hands right now. But we will see how that goes. For lashes today, I'm gonna use the House of Lashes in Knockout. They are really, really pretty. Now my eyes are done and I'm gonna move on to contour. So today I'm gonna use the Morphe 9C palette for contouring and I'm gonna use this shade right here. And the brush I'm gonna use is the MAC 
168 brush I think the text is gone so yeah but I think it's the 168 or 68 but it is the angled contour brush Um, I'm also gonna contour my nose with the same palette, but instead with the Morphe M422 brush. I'm gonna blend out the edges with my damp beauty blender and also bake with a jello powder. I'm gonna let the powder sit while I am doing my bronzer. And for bronzer today I'm gonna use my Too Faced Chocolate Soleil bronzer. And my favorite bronzer brush is the Morphe M462 brush. So for blush today I'm gonna use the NYX Sweet Cheeks palette and I'm gonna go in with this shade right here. and. For my blush I'm gonna use the Sueva Luxe Cheek Brush and it's the number 126. So for highlighter today I'm gonna use the Makeup Forever Pro... Pro... For highlighter today I'm gonna use the Makeup Forever Pro Light Fusion Undetectable Luminizer. And this is the color 2, I think. It's really beautiful. It's very golden. And I'm gonna apply it with my Morphe M510 brush. So now my look is almost done. I just have the lips left. And I think I'm gonna show you two different lip choices. So the first one, I'm gonna go in with the MAC Lip Liner in Whirl. Then I'm gonna go in with the MAC Lipstick in Honey Love. And to finish it off, I'm gonna go in with the NYX Mega Shine Lip Gloss in the shade Sugar Pie. So this is the first lip option. The second lip option is a bit darker and it is the Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lipstick in the color Sad Girl. And this is the second lip option. So guys, that was actually it for this video. I really hope you liked this Valentine tutorial. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next video. Bye!